What ICT means to me, it's the skill set of using technical knowledge to solve problems. What changed in ICT is access to knowledge. Things are just like really accelerating with, you know, artificial intelligence and virtual reality and augmented reality and things like that. You know, growing up, I always worked with computers. So I took comp sci at the University of Windsor. To be honest, it was a part of me all through university and even a little bit after that kind of doubt and second guessed that choice, even though I've always liked computers. And so it wasn't until I actually got a job totally not in my field at the call center. And then I saw this problem present itself where you have a ticketing system at most call centers and we were filling out two. I was thinking, how do I use my knowledge to solve that? On my own time, I created this software to kind of bridge those two systems. It was like a powerful moment for me. Okay, I do belong in this industry. All those years in university weren't a waste. Uh, my name is Evan Burns. I'm the lead developer here. My position at Red Piston is everything from developing mobile apps for Android and iOS to working with the clients. Definitely when I was younger, starting to get into video games, back into the Sega Genesis and the Game Boy Color, and then finally with Xbox when Halo came out, I really enjoyed the 3D aspect of gaming. So I originally got into the 3D modeling and design side of games. Um, and then eventually once MySpace came out, I started learning a little bit of HTML just to change your uh, profile. It made me realize maybe the game industry and programming was for me. What our hiring process is like, at least with software developers, is what we look for is someone who's not going to be an employee. We want someone who's going to be a team member. They want to build a career. They don't want just a job. They want to be part of a team. To have solutions to tackle problems, not just, you know, get a check at the end of the day. And that's what we look for. I want to explain to people more is the industry is a lot of fun. It's not a day-to-day -day boring office job. You have new projects coming in, so you're constantly trying new things, learning new technology. Every project's different. Yeah, so uh, Toronto, I thought might have been for me with the busyness of everything, but I wanted to come back to Windsor. Uh, the housing market was great. I felt there was more opportunity for me to grow as, as a developer and not just be lost in a big company. Red Piston was small enough for me to feel like I was making a difference. Here locally in Windsor, I think there's a lot of misconceptions. One, there's nothing here for you if you're a developer. Some of the other misconceptions is that you just need to have that piece of paper and boom, you get a job. The best thing you could do in this industry is do things outside of what you're taught. And shows that one, you have the passion for what you do, and two, that you're open and willing to expand that knowledge and you like to learn. Keep learning. Try to find that piece of passion to latch on to and then use that to help you accelerate your learning. Come over here. Then it doesn't feel like work. <laughs>